No, that's not ideal. Sketchy big swells across the top there as usual. Not great. Let's see if we can get a few casts in with a Still got my motor running here because I just want to make sure I'm, the anchor's all right. This sandy hole here is nine meters, but behind me there is not nine meters. And as you'll see, it's kind of intimidating to sit here sometimes. Um, actually, it's kind of intimidated to sit here most times, just about every time I come here. Good morning anyway. Um, a bit of a later start today, and I'll come out here to try and have a crack at some kingfish, but. Uh, as always, it's reliant on the swell around here and sometimes the swell is just too hectic and you just can't get close. Like, look at this one coming now. That looks so threatening. And then you just got to hope that it peters out here into this deeper hole, which generally does, but still doesn't make it look any less intimidating when you're sitting here. Um, again, I've, I'm sitting here in nine meters, so I know I'm pretty okay. Behind me over there, there's like a few bombies that come up to about a meter under the surface, so that's why it breaks there, but. It looks sketchy. It always makes me pretty nervous sitting in here. goal is to try to pop up a few kingfish. I've got this popper on that I got from um, Jubite Tackle. Splashing away with that and just see. They either turn up pretty quick. If they're going to turn up, they're normally pretty quick about it. If not, they're probably not going to turn up. Oh, there's one. Yeah, the kings are there. The kings are there. They're under the boat. Wow. There was kingfish under the boat there. I don't think they want this pop up. Let's see if I can drop this soft plastic down. They might want that. Well, I just get a um, get rigged up with this one here quickly. Stick a mule or something on this, I guess. Okay, let's bring this plastic in slowly. Wow! I hope that showed up on camera because they just swam right underneath the boat there. There's a whole pack of them that just swam right under the boat. A couple of them look pretty bloody big too. I'm just going to sort my boat out here, clean things up a bit. So I'm in a position to deal with one if I do hook one. Are they going to come back? Because I'm by myself, I only want one bait out at a time. Oh, they're down there. Oh, I just saw something. Wow, yeah, fish on. There it goes. Wow. Straight away, like I said that, I think I'm pretty sure I said that. Normally, if they're on, they show up straight away. You normally get a chance at one or two fish and then they're gone just as quick. 
I don't even know if this is a king. I feel like this might be a little snapper even. Yeah, this is a little snapper. Well, he's not little. Oh, what? Come on, dude. Look at that, beautiful little snapper from shallow water. He can go back, because it's not what I'm coming here for today. Thought I had one on there. I definitely saw him, that was definitely kings I saw in the barely before. So I mean, as soon as I pulled up here, I looked over the side and they were just there as I was winding that popper in. Sometimes they're just not in the feeding mood. It's just the way they are. They're funny, funny fish. Funny, fussy fish. Oh, what's that? Oh, there's a kingy right there. They're right there. They're right there. Always place to keep your eyes open because you just never know when they're just going to look. Can you see that? Can you see him? Can you see him? Come on, eat, 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 eat. Always place to keep your eyes open because you're just never sure when they're just going to come in like they just did then. Get a bit of a splash on the water. Where's that bait? Where's that bait? Where's that bait? Is it still bait on it? Oh, they're splashing that popper on the surface. Did you see that? Wow, they just had a crack at that. Surely someone's gonna eat that half muley there. Look at him, oh, oh, come on. Eat, 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 eat. Oh no, they just won't eat it. They just won't eat it. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm getting some attention over here. Yeah. All right. Oh, I didn't really want one on the 20 pound outfit. I would have preferred it on the 50. Oh, this is gonna be a nightmare now because I've got to try to get this guy away from all that reef over there. He's a heavy fish too. Oh, 20 pound is a little undercooked in these shallows like this. In the deeper water, okay. But in the shallows like this, 20 is a little underdone. Oh, these are angry, angry fish. to happen they were like splashing around I really hope the camera caught that when they were splashing around my popper and just following it and following it that's just kind of the way they are these kingfish so they're really really smart and they just see your leaders and they see the boat oh I didn't really want boats to come and see me hooked up here that's not what I wanted to see at all to be honest These boats are fully sussing me out now. Not ideal. I'm just gonna try to come over here, pretend I'm not hooked up. Keep driving, keep driving, nothing to see here. Come back around this side. Oh, just 
Just gotta keep my rods low because I don't want these guys to see me hooked up here. Really? I think it might be too late for that. Oh, that's right, they've moved on. Oh no, they haven't. As usual. Is he seriously going to go right across that? Oh, that's brave. Wouldn't have done that myself. Oh, solid fish. I'm having a hard time understanding if these guys in these boats going right across the top of the reef there like that. That's very, very brave or very, very stupid. You guys saw the waves that, I was, that were breaking there a minute ago. I've just driven right through that. Oh, this is a stubborn fish. I haven't even seen him yet. I'm pretty sure it's a king. Yeah, it's a king. Okay, I can see it. Oh, it's decent. I don't think he's finished. No, he's not finished. I'll get my net ready. This is the hard part with kings, the net time. Because they see nets and they see the boat and they don't like either. Oh, that was probably my shot at him there. If I can get him around. Yes. Oh. Crikey, that's a solid fish. There you go, solid king. I'm pretty happy with him. Yeah, that's what I came here for. What a beautiful looking fish. Look at the torpedo. What an absolute beast. Solid, solid fish. They just never give up these guys. Unreal, stoked. So it's the last day of the demersal season today. Or oh, not the last day, but the last weekend of the demersals. It all closes down again. I could be out fishing for jewfish, but I'm not. I got a jewfish last weekend. I've still got one fillet of that in the freezer at home. That's all I need. I know it's closing down for a few months and everyone wants to stock up their freezers, but I prefer to eat fish fresh if I can. And I don't like having a ton worth of fish frozen in my freezer, so. Everyone that fills their freezer with fillets, you can't tell me you haven't got to a point where you've dug to the bottom and found fillets that you've had to throw out because they've been sitting there for God knows how long. Um, I don't like to do that, so I try to keep an absolute minimum in the house. And um, yeah, in the... Oh! Oh, I didn't know! Woo! They're back in the off season. Um, I'll just come fish for kingfish or kish, fish for skippy or... Oh my god, that's so excited. That gave me a heart attack. Oh! 
Oh, I think there's a big school here, kiddies. Oh, wow. That scared the bejesus out of me. See that? And now they're gone, just as quick. Bang, they're here, and then suddenly, kaboom, they're gone. Oh, I'm spewing he didn't hook up there. He had it in his mouth, and it went under, and it pulled tight, and then he just spat it. Oh, they're still there. Oh, maybe I should click something else on. Maybe they just don't want this popper. I really want one on a popper, though. That was a hit. Oh yeah, the pack's on, they're on, they're on. Come on, hey. Oh, they're on it, they're on it. Hey, come on. Oh, there's one right on it. What's he doing? Are you gonna eat that or not? That might be a Samson fish. What was that? It was a bit brown for a kingfish, that one. Oh, hang on, I'm in over here. <laughs> Just got to get this popper out of the water because otherwise I'm going to have all sorts of trouble with this one. I nearly wore that in the head then. Okay, got a fish on here. I want to get this out of my way. I don't know what that was. That It was very brown for a kingfish, whatever was following my popper there. I feel like that might have been a Samson fish. I don't know what this is, but it wasn't that Sam's, it wasn't that fish that followed my popper because he scooped off that way and this bait was sitting out over there in the sand. Oh, solid fish. Solid waves coming in over the top. I feel like this one might be a king. Oh, what? It's another snapper, man. It's another really nice snapper. I'm almost wondering whether that was a snapper that followed my popper in before because it was really brown. Oh. Whoa, I nearly lost my net and everything there. There you go. Perfect. He's a solid little pinky. Probably 65-ish. 67 decent he's a decent fish got that little circle right in his mouth I'm actually gonna take this guy um, he'll join me for dinner tonight oh well I couldn't get on I couldn't get the kinks to eat again they hung around for a little while and then they bug it off which is pretty typical in king fashion they're there and then they're not there just as quick um, I'm happy I got uh, the beautiful snapper to eat and then the breeze whipped up so I decided to bolt home so I'm just at home now Closing off the boat. Um, anyway, that, that's it for this episode. If you like our videos, stay tuned and I'll see everyone in the next episode. Um, hopefully I'll be back into the Kings again because I'm definitely going to go back down to that spot and um, maybe try some live baits or something and see if I can tempt them with, uh, yeah, maybe a live herring or something because there were some big ones amongst them and I'd really love to get onto one of them. But yeah, if you like our videos, stay tuned and I'll see you guys all in the next episode and thanks everyone for watching.